Ryan. Welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the Internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows up. Everyone's having a great day, safe day. Make a great night, folks. Be impeccable with your word. Express your love. Impeccability of the word can be measured by a level of self-love. If you love yourself, you'll express that love in your interactions with others, and that action will do what? Will produce a like reaction. Market-wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials down 209, NASDAQ off 129, S&P's off 36. Gold, gold contract up $7, trading at 1964 an ounce. We have silver down four cents, twenty-two dollars sixty-eight cents an ounce. Light sweet crude, flat, seventy-five dollars forty-six cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. A ten-year note down twenty-five ticks, trading. There it goes. Trading at one hundred seven seventeen. The thirty-year down a full point plus twenty-five ticks at one thirteen oh one. And King Dollar, King Dollar trading up two hundred seventy-four ticks. Oh, this is going to get interesting. When I just did the update, folks, we're at three fourteen. So we're going to watch this King Dollar, man. This is going to be so cool watching it come in in the next hour. So King Dollar's up 273 ticks. It is in the higher range again, but we failed the last couple of days. We'll see how this shakes out in the next hour. We're at 105, 867. Euro's at 106. Yen's at 151. British Pound's at 122 to 1 U.S. dollar. Let me just go over to this dollar first for a second because we're still going for tick for tick on this dollar. And I'm not, uh, the IMF, I believe they're still talking. Yeah, see, this is the first downdraft all day since they start talking. So now let's go to the S&Ps. <coughs> this dollar doesn't hold it again. You're going to see, you're going to see the S&Ps basically come off this low. We've been on this low now. You can see that, that I get the futures up here. We've been on this low like for 50 minutes, okay? And the last time that you had any juice was at the four three six six. This is coming off the lows, man. You know, I suspect we'll get to at least four, three, seven, five. You know, you see, see the volume there? That, that's where I'm picking that point. When you, when you come down, most times it's like, that's the biggest volume bar. So if you can get off the bottom, you normally come up to that point, you build some cars, and it will depend on what the volumes are up at that point. And then if we do this, let's do this for a second. Just curious as to what that would be. Look at that. Yeah, see, that's only a 0 0.382 retracement also. So it's going to be important when we get up there. And that, just uh, that number again, 4375, folks. So 4375. And if the S&Ps come in with volume at that point, they'll bust right through it. Let's go to the NQs and take a look at the NQs. I suspect it's going to be pretty close to the same. Yeah, it is. So the NQs, the number on the NQs, we're at uh, 15,259. We're talking there 15,305. You know, so that's 45 points higher. And if we look at the NQs, the difference with the NQs, yeah, look at this. Oh, this is pretty cool. Yeah, watch this. Look at this. We're going to bounce. The difference with the NQs, see this right here? That right there, that's where we bounced. And on the NQs, that's 30, let me get this straight, 30,000 contracts versus 19, no, versus 13. You can see, see how that works? You, you're coming into the strength from two days ago. You had 30,000 contracts, and we stacked going higher. You just did, did I say 19? Right there. I only did 13. Yeah, there's no more sellers there then. And watch the NQs. The NQs are going to be stronger. So the NQs more than likely will come off first. Uh, notes and bonds. We get the 10 year right now yielding 4.622, which is that's a, that's a fast move, no doubt about that. Uh, we look at the gold contract. What we have with gold is you did reject lower price today. You're going to have lighter volume. Rejected lower price at the 1948 level. And that was. Basically, $3 above where 
the real strength was. That's when we when we had taken taken off uh, topside. Actually, that's the highs of it. Though. So this is positive, man, big time. Look at this. So that's the. I was bringing this up yesterday. Yeah, it didn't even get down to that level. It didn't even get down to the second sign of strength. We had two different signs of strength on gold coming off the lows. Actually, it's free. And it got down to the second one, but it didn't get to the bottom of it. So what you have out here today, you're doing 1.8 million contracts versus two, 200, no, 180,000 contracts versus 270,000. So once again, it's going to try to make it up. Now, this is where the guy's cool. We'll see what we get at it, you know, if we've just set up an ABC up. We've set it up, but the real question is, is that as it attacks the B point, you know, is it going to have the volume to take it out? Because this is a very minor pullback. It didn't even do a 0 0.382. So if you look at this, this could be a very large ABC structure up. 2019. Well, that's a beauty, man. You're talking about uh, 27, 37, 46 points, which would get you to, what is that? 19, 48. Oh, 40. Yeah. That's, that's 19, well, it's 1996. What was the last high up there? Well, I see. Last high was, uh, is that right? Yeah, all that's going to do is get you to the highs. We go take a look at some of the higher volume equities out here. You have uh, Tesla's down 13 bucks. We get, well, let's go inside the NDX first. We take a look at the NDX, and you got Marvell Technology. That's uh, up at 2.8%. You got Micron up 2.3. Warner Brothers, that's up 2%. Uh, Take it away from a Tesla's down 6. You got Lucent off 4.5. Uh, you get uh, Global Foundry off 3. Let's go look at this one for a second. This is pretty intense. So there's a story on Bloomberg today. You know, this was one of these sparks, folks, okay? So when you take a look at Lucent and what it was, you know, the first owners that came in and bought bought this it happened, happened to be the Saudi fund, they're down 90%. But if we look at this chart, what you're going to see is that, yeah, it's down 90%. It went, this has been a one-way move from $57 to $3.70. How's that? Stay right there, folks. Come right back. We have the Dow. The Dow Industrials right now is trading down 187. NASDAQ off 119. S&P's off 33. We'll come right back. Currencies, commodities, and bond markets are as important as ever right now with how they're driving the volatility in equity markets across the globe, which is why it's a great time to try out Teddy Kegstat's Tiger Forex Report. Teddy Kegstat breaks down the Forex markets every Monday using his 30-plus years of experience as a trading veteran of futures, Forex, stocks, and options. Teddy releases his weekly Tiger Forex Report every Monday morning with coverage of all the major currency pairs, including the dollar index, the euro dollar, pound dollar, dollar Swiss, dollar yen as well as many more and he also has weekly coverage of the crude oil market and the 30-year t-bonds as they both influence forex markets tremendously when you sign up for the tiger forex report you also gain instant access to teddy's 60-minute webinar archive he just hosted forex strategies and fundamentals what is behind the tiger forex report for all the details and to start your 30-day tiger forex report subscription today visit the front page of tfnn.com tfnn educating investors are you ready to take your trading to the next level? Introducing Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, your key to successful active trading. Tom O'Brien, renowned for his expertise in the financial markets, has designed Market Insights to be your daily guide to profitable trades. Tom publishes his daily Market Insights newsletter every market day before the market open, along with updates when warranted. Stay ahead of the game with Tom's real-time analysis and trade recommendations delivered straight to your inbox. Whether you're a seasoned trader or just starting out, Market Insights provides the edge you need to navigate the markets with confidence. Ready to join the ranks of successful traders? Head over to TFNN.com and subscribe to Market Insights today. Don't miss out on this opportunity to supercharge your trading results. Market Insights comes with a 30-day money-back guarantee for all new subscribers, so you have nothing to risk. 
Don't miss out on this opportunity to revolutionize your trading game. Head over to TFNN.com right now to join the thousands of traders who have already experienced the power of Tom O'Brien's award-winning newsletter, Market Insights, firsthand. TFNN, educating investors.